Dear students, let's go for this question number two of exercise 12a where we have to draw angle by sector. So if you look at angle A is given as 56 degree and we have to construct angle by sector of this angle. So what I have done here, I have uh, taken a line segment AB and you can take this line segment AB of any length because at, at it, it is not mentioned in the question. So I have taken this line segment AB here and now I have to construct angle 56 degree at point A. So what I will do, I have to place protector here at point A in a way that uh, the vertex of the angle is lined up with the center of the protector. And then I have to mark here at 56 degrees exactly and I will uh, read this inner scale for this case and I have to mark it over here. And you know that you have to use a pencil. I'm using this marker so that it is uh, clearly visible to you people. Now, I have to draw the second arm of the angle this way. Now, I have constructed this angle and this angle is 56 degree, okay? This angle is 56 degree. Now, I have to construct angle bisector of this angle. I can mark this point as point C. <clears throat> now, in order to construct angle bisector, what I will do, I will uh, take a compass and I will open uh, a suitable compass here and I will mark two arcs. One arc I will mark on one arm and the other I will draw on the second arc, second arm. Now, you will not disturb the compass, but you will place this compass now at this point where your first arc is. And once again, you will draw another arc here, this way. And then once again, you will put your compass at the second arm where the previous arc cut it. And then you will once again draw another arc. Now you see that uh, these two arcs cut each other here so what I will do now I will take a ruler and from point A I'm going to draw a line which is passing through the point of intersection of these two arcs okay what I have done here I have joined this point A with the point of intersection of these two arcs so this way I have constructed angle bisector of this angle A so this means that this line this line is going to split this whole angle 56 into two equal parts so this means that if the whole angle was 56 this is going to be 28 degrees and this is also 28 degree and you can label it as d so this means that this ad line has splitted this whole angle into two equal parts and this is called angle bisector of uh, angle a